done watching this video, go play the One Pod Bandit over on Phone Dog or our Facebook page. You can win an iPod Touch. You can win a cell phone. It's free. It's easy. You can play 10 times a day. All right? Go do it. Good luck. Hey, what's going on, everybody? I'm Noah from PhoneDog.com. And a uh, little shout out to my friends back in the 718 where I used to live. If you're in Brooklyn and you want some fine... No, I'm not going to give a free promo, but uh, it's a good place. Anyway, what's going on, everybody? Uh, at long last, by popular demand, I've got something in here that I know at least some of you want to see because you keep asking about it. And uh, I have to say that um, if I had any illusions that I was becoming, you know, some kind of a personality, some kind of a, a you know... I'm going to say celebrity because I'm obviously not a celebrity, but somebody who people in the media recognize and everything, waiting for this phone put me in my place because I know Hayden from Heroes has hers. I've seen her in her pool party on TV, you know, flaunting this around. I could not get one until finally today. Thank you to the folks at LG for sending this over. It's the LG Xenon, one of uh, the new AT&T messaging phones that was launched just before CTIA. A lot of people thinking about this one as a competitor to the Samsung Impression because it's a touchscreen and a QWERTY. Uh, it's a little bit cheaper than the Impression out of the box, so you know, I, I smell dogfight at some point, right? I didn't make that up. You guys have been saying that to me for, for weeks now. Where's the Xenon? I'm doing dogfight! Rah, rah, rah. Well, we'll get to that. Right now, let's just unbox it. Alright, so here you go, the LG Xenon. And, uh, how do you open this thing? This is how you open it. Touchscreen, mobile email, text and picture, picture messaging, two MP camera. MP's megapixels. I know that because I'm a professional. And a music player. Inside the box, you get the phone. I got the red one. We'll get to that in a second. Underneath there, you get a charger. And that's it. You get a battery, but the battery's already in the phone for me. And then you get some manuals. Uh, you know, <laughs> not much. If you buy an unlocked phone or you buy a high-end phone, you get a little more, maybe. Otherwise, you get uh, a list of optional accessories that you can purchase. But uh, none of them come with the phone. So I guess that makes the unboxing a little bit shorter, right? So here's the phone itself. It's got this crazy pattern on the back. You can see, ooh, the light from my camera is making all kinds of crazy... Yeah, you don't want to see that. All right, we'll fire this up. And uh, maybe I should kill the light, actually. It's reflecting off the screen. Is there any battery power? That's the big question. There we go. All right, so while this is firing up, uh, we'll take a look around. On the front, you've got a touch screen. You've got call, cancel buttons. Also, that doubles as a power button. You've got your shortcuts menu button. On the right panel, micro SD card slot, lock switch, camera button. On the back, two megapixel camera with flash little step up from uh, the LG View, which I think that was the last AT&T LG touchscreen phone, wasn't it? That one did not have a, uh, a flash on it. This one does. On the other side of the phone, you've got your uh, rocker switch for volume, little, little uh, you know, port there, holes, whatever you call them for your wrist strap. What do you call them when it's for your wrist strap, anyway? Port? It's not a jack. I don't know. On top, here's your accessory port for your uh, headphones and your charger. I think this one is, uh, oh no, it's, okay, good. USB based. I'd like to see that. Insert SIM. All right, we're going to have to insert the SIM. Uh, we'll open the phone up real quick and slides open. You've got your full QWERTY board there. We will, uh, ooh, emoticon button. I'd like to see that. We'll get to that in a second. By the way, there's me behind the camera. Shaved my head this morning. Too bad you can't see it. It looks nice. Uh, we'll open the phone up here. We'll pop a SIM card in. 950 milliamp hour battery, so hopefully that's going to be enough juice to power this thing uh, in a day's full of 3G usage when you're out at the pool party like Hayden. You know what I'm talking about, right? The LG commercial, the AT&T commercial for this phone. I haven't been watching Heroes this season. I kind of, I don't know, Heroes and Lost, I kind of fell off the bandwagon this season, and instead i uh, been watching, I've actually been watching Fringe, which a lot of people make fun of me for, but I think, uh, I just think the kooky old professor is funny, and I like the chemistry between uh, Pacey and Anna Torv, and the show's sort of like, it's kind of dumb enough that um, I don't have to really pay attention and I can still enjoy it, 
Whereas with Lost, I'm always kind of like, I forget all the different storylines, and I just, I don't want to think that hard when I'm watching TV. Anyway, firing the phone back up here. So we'll do a little touch calibration. No stylus. Getting a little haptic feedback. Alright, press it again for accuracy. Apparently I'm not very active, it lets me know. There you go. I mean, not active, rather, uh, accurate. Let's me know just how inaccurate I am. Thanks. Startup guide. Yeah, let's do the startup guide. Oh, nice little animations. I like these new guides that teach you how to use your phone. Because a lot of people, you know, more and more, uh, especially with the Twitter and Facebook and all that stuff, it's like the other editors at PhoneDog and myself, we feel almost like tech support people uh, answering these questions about how to use the phones and people don't know all the features they have and everything. So I don't know if anybody will actually watch this, but it's kind of cool that they bothered to do it. So we'll get out of that, though. I don't want to copy the contacts. Thank you. And we'll get into this more later, but, um, you know, the, these, these user interfaces becoming more and more advanced in terms of the functionality. And this one you've got you know, three different sets of contacts you can have. And uh, you can set your screen up different ways. You can customize the look. Customize what shortcuts are on there. So you can have your home screen, your favorite screen for your favorite contacts, and then your, uh, your, favorite, sc your contacts favorite screen, and then your application's favorite screen there as well. Then we can go back to home, and you've got this little shortcut menu that pops out to get you access to your different things that you're using. You can see now my SIM card's loaded up, AT&T. I've got the 3G service up there in the corner, you can see. Then you can hit the shortcut, your task menu. So all kinds of different ways you can customize this phone. Get your shortcuts. Here's a quick look at the QWERTY. We'll, uh, we'll just start a new message here, see how the QWERTY is. I didn't want caps, I just wanted shift. Oh well. And there you go. Moticon? Oh, that's an instant messenger button. Ew, okay. Go back to message composition there. And uh, the keyboard feels good. I like these keyboards that have a little bit of travel but a, a firm click to it. Not too mushy, soft grip plastic. Um, you know, a little bit of separation between the keys. They're they're not um, not as domed as some of the the keys are, but on first uh, first touch here, they feel pretty good. And uh, let's go back. Let's put in an exclamation point there. How do we do that function? Boom! There you go. All right. So uh, I'm going to send this to Hayden's number, but I don't want to show you Hayden's number because I, I don't want to do that to her because I might get in trouble with Hero. All right, a first look unboxing at the LG Xenon for AT&T. Liking this phone so far, just out of the box. Nice feel to it, a little bit smaller than the impression. Uh, it's got some stuff with the home screen, your contact menus, and all that that I'm going to get into and, and learn how it works before I show you because I don't want to waste your time. But so far, liking the feel of this one, and uh, we'll have to do more with it. And, you know, obviously that, that Xenon dogfight. Uh, Xenon impression dogfight. There you go, Noah. Wake up now. The Xenon Impression Dogfight is something that I think might, might be coming down the line. But on $99 official launch price, on contract for the LG Xenon, and I bet you can find it cheaper if you look on Phone Dog. I'm just saying. Till next time, I'm Noah from Phone Dog behind the camera. Hayden, if you're out there, I hope your leg heals up. Get better soon, all right? I'll text you. Bye-bye.